Hey everyone, Chris from Midwest Coaster Fans. Looking at the letters that are spelled out here. T for the, E for end, O for of, T for the, W for world. I don't know why it took me a second to do that. A for as, and then W for we, and K for no. I for it. And then you look at the small details on here, and I had to do a voiceover because of the loud noise around me. But there's different graphs and variations, and then you have the 11 colon AZ on the first one that we just saw, and how many tests are administered, the test results, the test purposes, 11 colon SD. There's different abbreviations going on here. And I believe this is just going to give certain indications of the type of elements that the ride's going to have and these different tests that show what the ride's going to have. So you have that long launch, uh, you have that long track. So we wonder if it's going to be a, a launch coaster that's going to go a launch giga or a lift system. We just know that there's a lift, but we don't know what kind of lift it is. I don't know. There's just a bunch of different things going on here. And B&M's kind of already... Um, done their own in the house um launch system with thunderbird at holiday world so maybe they're planning on doing it over here at king's island too who knows or it's just going to be a lift system uh what we do know is it's going to probably have inversions it's probably going to have a different types of elements positive g's negative g's because that's what the different test results are showing that's going to have different effects on the body and stuff like that. So there's a full board there. And as we were, we record the voiceover today, I had a couple friends tell me that nothing's changed at the park. So those are the complete posters, which totals nine of them, which is spells out the end of the world as we know it, which is also an REM song. And if you looked at our prior video, we already spelled out that we showed you some lyrics in there that kind of identified some of these different posters, these different elements and these posters are located right next to Flight of Fear, so go ahead and check it out if you get a chance, um, if you end up going to Kings Island. Then I also went up to the Eiffel Tower and got some shots uh, for you guys. Um, just uh, These are just shots of some uh, footers. There's nothing really special about any of these shots at all. Uh, there's no vertical things going on. You could see the Firehawk um, train still in the background, so I don't know if they're going to use that kind of as a theme of the area. Uh, obviously, they might repurpose that for something else. And then you can see the clearing all the way back there, but nothing going vertical at this moment. We have not had any announcements. So hopefully this upcoming week we'll hear something about the announcement date. Please subscribe to our channel for future content. This is Midwest Coaster Fans. Chris signing out. Until next time.